Hello everyone, Namaste. Welcome back to my channel Academic Tuber. Today we are going to discuss chapter 21 from grade 8 science that is weather and climate. Before that if you are new to this channel please subscribe to the channel and for more updates hit the bell icon. If you want more videos related to this please like and do share this video among your friends and don't forget to give your valuable response in comment section. Weather the specific climatic condition of a particular place at a particular period of time is called weather. Whether it is the sum of all processes occurring in a particular area at a particular time. Weather refers to a day-to-day -day temperature, rainfall, humidity, sunshine, etc. The weather occurs due to difference in temperature and moisture of different places. The weather includes wind, cloud, rain, snow, frost, etc. Characteristics of weather The atmospheric condition of a place in the morning, at noon, and in the evening may be different. It may be sunny at a place, but it may be cloudy or rainy in another place. The branch of science that deals with the history of weather is known as metrology, and the person who study metrology, they are known as the metrologist. Climate Climate is the average weather condition of a place over a long period of time. In other words, it is the average weather pattern of a place over the whole year. For the climatic average, a minimum period of 35 years is needed. The climate of a particular place is determined with the help of systematic observation, recording, and analysis of various factors such as temperature, rainfall, wind, cloud, sunshine, humidity, atmospheric pressure, etc. The branch of science that deals with the history of climate is known as the climatology. The climate, of different, the climate is different in different places. World is divided into three main climatic regions. They are tropical, temperate, and tundra. Climate of who? Climate is one of the major factors that determine the types of natural vegetation, animals, and modes of human life and their activities. We do not experience similar type of climate at the same place in different parts of the world. The major factors that affect the climate of a place are distance from the equator or latitude, height from the sea level, slope of mountains, distance from the sea, forest and vegetation, river and lakes, local winds, human activities, etc. Distance from the equator, latitude is the angular distance to the north and south of the equator. Equator is the imaginary line which passes from east to west to a center of earth. It lies at zero degree latitude where the sun rays are direct and straight and have more effect of heating. So it is hot in equatorial region. But as the distance from the equator increases, sun rays become tilted and in the north and in the poles which lie 90 degree latitude get the most tilted sun rays. So it is very cold in the polar regions. Next factor affecting uh, climate is height from the sea level or altitude. Altitude is the height of the place from the sea level. When the altitude increases, temperature decreases and vice versa. In every 160 to 165 meter altitude, temperature decreases by 1 degree Celsius. This is the reason why Thorai region has hot climate and mountain region has cold climate. The density of air is higher at the lower altitude as it contains carbon dioxide, dust particles, nitrogen, nitrogen oxides, water vapor, etc. Due to these factors, the atmosphere at lower altitude absorbs more heat, and the temperature at higher altitude is thinner and absorbs less heat. Next one is slope of mountains. The slope of mountains towards the monsoon window are windward slopes which get more rainfall while the slopes on the opposite sides are leeward slopes which often remain dry. Pokhara lies in the windward slope of Annapurna rain so it receives more rainfall during mon it so it receives more rainfall but Manang and Mustang lie in the leeward slope and are dry. Similarly all parts of slope do not get the equal amount of sunlight these uh, factors affect the climate of slope. Next one is distance from the sea. The climate of a place is also affected by the distance from the sea. The places near the sea get more influence of sea breeze during the daytime and land breeze during the nighttime, which makes the climate near the sea moderate. 
but the influence of breeze is less in the places far away from the sea so the climate of the place that remain far away from the sea is more extreme that is very hot in day and very cold in night a soft and the gentle wind that blows mainly in the sea area is called the breeze and the breeze are categorized into two types on the basis of their origin they are land breeze and sea breeze the blow of cold air from sea to land during the daytime is known as the sea breeze whereas the flow blow of air from land to sea during night time is known as the land breeze now we are going to discuss the climate of nepal on the basis of latitude nepal lies in the tropical monsoon climatic region but the climate is of varied type on the basis of altitude like the tropical subtropical cold and tundra tropical climate is found in the belt between 60 meter to 1200 meter in the tarai region the land is the land of this area is fertile and consists of tropical evergreen forest the temperature reaches up to 40 degrees celsius during summer and falls down to 6 degrees celsius in winter from 1200 meter to 2100 meter from the sea level the climate is moderate it is warmer in the river basin and valleys deciduous vegetation is found in this region the temperature reaches up to 30 degrees celsius during summer and falls down to 0 degrees celsius in winter between 2100 meter to 3300 meter altitude in the mid hill region climate is cool temperate coniferous forests are found in this region the temperature reaches up to 20 degrees Celsius during summer and falls below 0 degrees Celsius in winter. In the higher altitude, between 3300 meter to 5500 uh, meter, the climate is cold. The temperature reaches up to 15 degrees Celsius during summer and falls below the freezing point in the winter. And above 5000 meter, the climate is very cold. This region is called Tundra region. No vegetation is found in this region. The temperature of this region is always below the freezing point. Climate of Nepal varies due to influence of wind. In summer, rainfall occurs due to the influence of most sum moist summer monsoon wind which comes from the Bay of Bengal. Whereas winter is dry due to the influence of dry winter monsoon winds which blows from the Central Asia. However, some rainfall occurs in winter due to the influence of westerly wind blowing from the west which comes from the mediterranean sea winter rain in nepal is more in the west and less in the east monsoon monsoon is the periodic or the seasonal wind that blows from the sea to the land and land to the sea in nepal monsoon begins with rainfall chaitra Baisak, and jester in nepal are the month of pre-monsoon the climate is moist mostly hot and dry Asa, Shravan and Bhadra are the month of mid-monsoon. About 90% of rainfall occurs during the mid-monsoon. Similarly, Ashwin and Kartik are the month of late monsoon. Monsoon climate is found in the Southeast Asia, China, Korea, etc. Characteristics of Monsoon Habit rainfall in summer and dry in winter. It makes the climate cool in mid-summer. Winter Monsoon During winter, water is relatively warmer than land. Due to this, atmospheric pressure is higher on the land than in the ocean. As a result, cold wind moves from land to sea since it does not get any source of moisture. It is dry and cannot cause rainfall. Next one is summer monsoon. So during this, land is relatively warmer and ocean are relatively colder. This causes high atmospheric pressure in ocean and low atmospheric pressure in land. Due to this reason, moisture bearing wind blows from ocean to the land which causes heavy rainfall. Effects of Monsoon It is the major source of irrigation. It increases the level of underground water. River. Rivers contain large volume of water which helps in produce gen generating more hydroelectricity. Monsoon makes the climate cool in mid-summer. Loss of life and property due to flood and landslide. Methods of reducing the negative impact of monsoon. Monsoon, it has both positive and negative impacts. Here are some of the methods for reducing the negative impacts of monsoon. Conservation of forest resources. Construction of uh, retaining walls, walls at the bank of rivers. Afforestation program should be launched. 
forecast can be done about flooding and let people know about it in advance now we are going to discuss some of the questions related with this unit more rainfall occurs in Pokhara and less rainfall occurs in Manangwai. Pokhara lies in windward windward slope of mountain and receives highest amount of rainfall but Manang lies in leeward slope of mountain and receives less rainfall Winter crops grow better in western Nepal. Why? Winter crops grow better in western Nepal because in winter more rainfall occurs in the western Nepal than eastern Nepal. Rice production is more in Japa. Why? Rice production is more in Japa because happy rainfall occurs in mid monsoon in Japa. More landslide occurs in eastern hilly region of Nepal. Why? More landslide occurs in eastern hilly region of Nepal because heavy rainfall occurs in monsoon in eastern hilly region of Nepal. How is monsoon produced? Describe in brief. In winter, higher air pressure prevails in the land of Nepal, but air pressure in is low in Indian Ocean. So cold and dry air blows from Nepal to Bay of Bengal, which is called winter monsoon wind, which is dry and does not cause rainfall. But in summer, moisture bearing summer monsoon wind blows from Bay of Bengal to Nepal, which brings plenty of rainfall. In this way, monsoon is produced. Differences between weather and climate Whether it is the specific weather condition of a particular place at a particular time, whereas climate, it is the average weather condition of a place over a long period of time. Whether it may be different in the morning, at noon, and in the evening, climate, it remains the same throughout the year differences between tropical climate and temperate climate tropical climate it occurs from altitude of 60 meter to 1200 meter from sea level whereas temperate climate temperate climate it occurs from the altitude of 2100 meter to 3300 meter from the sea level tropical climate the in tropical climate the evergreen forests are found in this climatic region whereas the temperate climate coniferous forests are found in this climatic region differences between tropical climate and tundra climate tropical climate tropical climate it occurs from the altitude of 60 meter to 1200 meter from sea level whereas tundra climate it occurs from the altitude of 5000 meter and more from the sea level Tropical climate, the evergreen forests are found in this climate zone, whereas in tundra climate, no vegetation exists. Differences between subtropical and cold climate. Subtropical climate, it occurs from the altitude of 3300 meter to 5000 meter from sea level, whereas cold climate, it occurs from the altitude of 5000 meter and more from the mean sea level. Tropical, subtropical climate, deciduous forest is found in this climatic region. In uh, cold climate, no vegetation exists in this climatic region. By this, we have completed a note of this unit, weather and climate. I hope this video was useful to you. If you like this video, please share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any queries, drop the comment in the comment section. See you on the next video. Thank you.